Hello, I'm Tim Kelly and this is our family's 1952 Jow Javelin. It's uh, an Australian assembled Jow Javelin uh, put together by Martin and King in Melbourne. Um, it was my grandfather's car from about 1959 through to 1963 and then it was sold out of the family and we didn't hear of it for nearly 50 years. Fortunately I was able to come across the car being sold in Campbelltown, not far from where it was originally housed at Stonyfield where my grandparents lived. It required a lot of work. We've um, restored it in the preservation class. So I've maintained all of the upholstery. It's still got its original hood lining, its original seats, its original engine. I've unseated the engine, but I haven't restored it. It runs beautifully. I've preserved all of the original British Racing Green metallic paint under the hood and kept everything as, as it was. So it's an extremely original car. This car has all of its books, its log books in there and everything. The way it smells and feels is exactly like you would expect a car from the 1950s to feel. Inside the boot, it's quite spacious for a couple of suitcases and a toolbox. We also have a really neat little tool tray in the Jowett's. This one has all of its original tools. It's a standard javelin, so it doesn't have the extra tray on it, but it's got its tools inside a little tool roll. It's air pump and jack, Stevenson's jack, and a really neat little way to wind down the uh, spare wheel from here as well. And we we're really disappointed this year that we weren't able to go in the Beta Birdwood run. Um, I've gone in the Beta Birdwood run since 1982. But we're pleased that this car is back on the road, road registered, so we can take it out and people, future generations, current generations can see the types of cars that we were driving in the 1950s.